morning everyone so this is a uh, question id 287h27045290 beta this question can also be challenged it is my humble request that whenever any one of you would challenge a question don't challenge it without proof please don't challenge it based on uh, internet sources based on random sources you should have a thorough proof of it and internet is not a proof agar internet pe ja, ja kar main koi blog likh deti hu then that is not a proof of anything you need to, you can also go ahead and write something on the internet it does not mean it is correct right so to prove something you need to pick up a publication to prove something you need a book in hand उस बुक के बेसिस पे ओनली इफ यू हैव यू नो इफ यू हैव सीन दैट इन द बुक तब यू कैन गो हेड एंड क्लेम इट कि दिस बुक सेज दैट दिस इज दिस 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 राइट सो इन दिस क्वेश्चन इट सेज व्हिच ऑफ द फॉलोइंग स्टेटमेंट रिफ्लेक्ट्स द प्रॉपर्टी ऑफ टी डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन एंड द करेक्ट आंसर गिवन टू यू इज 4 व्हिच मींस ए एंड सी ओनली अब ध्यान से देखो बच्चे दिस इज सेइंग that it ranges from minus infinity to infinity that is correct actually it's saying its mean is the average of x hame nahi bataya gaya ki x kya hai and we know that you know the t distributions mean is actually averaged around 0 to x kya hai is not known to us and this statement does not make sense it ranges from 0 to infinity beta ye to waise hi galat ho jata hai the moment a is correct c becomes incorrect so this is also incorrect and it does not vary with changes in degree of freedom which is incorrect option it changes as the degree of freedom changes so to prove these statements i have taken this snip from sc gupta again and if you just type sc gupta statistics you will be able to go ahead and get a pdf of it you can download that pdf from google aur yahan pe i am referring to the graph 14.2.6 which shows everything together to pehla to it is showing that it is varying from minus infinity to infinity so it varies from minus infinity to infinity and that is exactly what is mentioned here it goes from minus infinity to infinity so that is a correct statement secondly it says it is symmetrical along the line t equal to 0 so this is actually its mean along with it is symmetrical so this statement is also uh, you know the mean x makes no sense there and if you go ahead and you see it also shows you for different degrees of freedom right it also goes ahead and shows you for different degrees of freedom which means that the curve varies as the degree degree of freedom varies right so on that basis we can say that the only statement which is true is statement a now many of you because you know that statement c and d were incorrect ye dono definitely incorrect the so many of you have gone ahead and marked answer as one which is a and b If I would have been at your place और मुझे एक मार्क करना होता तो मैं भी शायद वन के साथ की जाती बिकॉज द अदर थ्री यूर अदर टू सी एंड डी आर डेफिनेटली इन करेक्ट बट आइडियली दिस क्वेश्चन शुड बी ड्रॉप एंड ऑल ऑफ यू शुड बी गेटिंग मार्क्स फॉर इट बिकॉज इट्स मीन इज द एवरेज ऑफ एक्स इसका मतलब क्या बन रहा है यहाँ पे is not making sense. and if they don't drop this question to bhi unki answer ki galat galat hogi d is definitely incorrect we can still go with one best fit option but mere hisab se the question should be dropped so i would request you you can go ahead and challenge this question but as i have told you whenever you will challenge any question you need to go ahead and you need to give the source you need to give this snip so we are referring to sc gupta 14.2.6 diagram right okay beta thank you